Back court side, Warrior Arena, Horton Court, Dave Rosenthal with the head coach of the Warriors, Mark Darnell. A, uh, an L today, another set of building blocks for the Warriors in a 78-72 defeat, a game which saw the Hustle and Owls race out to a 9 nothing lead before the Warriors even got on the board. Mark, good to have you, uh, but bad to have you. And I know what our agreement is, who we talked to after the game, and I said pregame, I don't ever want to talk to Coach Darnell again. No, I, I uh, yeah, that's the deal. I mean, the players get to, they take all the credit on the wins, and I, I take the head on the losses. And so, um, you know, I'm, I'm proud of our effort tonight, man. We're, we're improving. That, that's a really good team. They just took the number two team in the country, um, you know, and, and battled with them and uh, beat a, a good Bethel team. So uh, I'm really impressed with their team. So how we competed tonight I thought was good. We got off to a slow start. They went on that 9-0 run, and, you know, look at the game end score, right? And so, um, you know, we got off to a slow start at Maritime and got off to a slow start here again. We've been hit and miss with it. We've also had some quick starts, you know, at, at Davis and uh, against Southern Oregon. So um, we just always got to be ready and, and find ways to compete right off the jump. Um, but you know what? I, I, I really like what I'm seeing from our guys and just got to go back and find ways to continue to pinpoint some stuff to improve on. Yeah, we've, we've cut down on the turnovers, which is a great thing. Uh, I'm looking at the turnover battle tonight. I think it was 11-11 points off turnovers. They picked up 12. We picked up six. Yeah. And you can look at that as well and say, okay, there's, there's your six-point difference right there. Yeah. No, we took care of the ball. They're, they're not a really deny team. They're a gap team. So they did let us move the ball around a little more. So I'm glad, I'm glad that number wasn't up. It shouldn't have been up. Um, you know, we forced it a little bit sometimes, uh, trying to drive a little too early when we don't have an advantage or being inside and they're shrinking the floor, you know, because we do have some pretty good size. Uh, but proud of our, our turnovers is definitely improved, and we need to keep it there to try to have success. That helps us. Yeah, some other things I noticed on the court tonight, Duke Gibson put in some good numbers tonight and didn't really get in foul trouble like we've seen him do earlier in the season. Yeah, no, Duke gave us big minutes off the bench. He's a bit able to score inside. I like his aggression, and um, he's just getting better every day. got to keep him getting better every day. Yeah, and, of course, uh, you're Ozzie. The man yeah. just comes to work and puts in a daze. Yeah, I'm proud of Aiden. I had to play him too much tonight. I couldn't find ways to get him out, but he was playing so good that I just I couldn't find a way to get him out. Well, so he's, 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 he, uh, he manned up tonight and stuck with it and, and uh, gave us a huge lift and did some really good things. So, uh, really pleased with what we're seeing from Aiden right now. I think the whole team should go to the Vegemite diet. <laughs> the Vegemite diet, I, that might be the secret. We I'm might telling have to talk you, about that. watch out on the 14th on your breakfast that day. Somebody, me, is bringing Vegemite. Yeah. Somebody, me, is ordering toast. <laughs> and everybody's going to try it. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> so yeah. wh where do we go from here? we got Simpson coming up, what, Tuesday night? Another yeah. opportunity to build upon what we've already started here this season. Yeah, the games aren't slowing down. we got three more games again next week. So, you know, we're just really trying to, as a staff, manage their bodies while also finding ways uh, to improve. And for us right now, it's a lot of walkthrough. It's a lot of film because um, that's the way uh, we can show them because we're, we're not able to get a lot of live practice time in right now because um, we need to – uh, make sure we have our guys to play. And so we're fortunate right now we've had, and knock on wood, we got to keep that going. Um, we're lucky to get Ty back next week, so Ty will be back coming in, in, in the Portland. But a good Simpson team that we need to make sure we're dialed and ready and locked into uh, what they want to do and uh, find ways from this game to improve and, and try to improve on things from this game. And that's what we do, brick by brick. We keep improving until we get to league season, which is coming up after the first of the year. Coach Mark Darnell joining us post game after a loss, 78-72. But we got another shot at it Tuesday night. Yes, we do. So All right. appreciate it. Thanks, Dave. You betcha. Right. That's Mark Darnell. I'm Dave Rosenthal. I'll do it for this one. 78-72, your final here from Warrior Arena. Stick around. we got more basketball coming up later on this evening, 6.30, start against PUC. Until then, enjoy the rest of your Saturday afternoon. We'll see you in just a little while right here at Warrior Arena.